Now, first of all, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know a thing. <laughs> I Googled a little bit and I saw that sweet and sour sauce requires ketchup, vinegar, brown sugar, and I saw somewhere about soy sauce. So I was like, you know what, let's throw that in too. Why not? There was some that was saying rice vinegar, some that was saying apple cider, but I just re use regular white vinegar. Because I'm like, oh, it's sweet and sour. That's where the sour comes from, and the brown sugar must be the sweet. Okay. So I was adding and adding and bubbling and bubbling the pot. I ended up adding more sugar and more sugar, and I'm like, ugh, I don't want to add too much sugar. I'm not really a sugary person. I don't use it a lot. So I was just like, all right, whatever will be. I tasted it a little by little. And I was just content with how it was and frankly I was over it so I had boiled my chickpeas from before and now I'm just pouring the sauce on there because my favorite meal used to be sweet and sour chicken with fried rice and something else I can't remember what else was in the tray or sometimes I get sweet and sour chicken with white rice and they would either have it in a cup on the side but in the last few years when I used to get Chinese food they had it poured on the food just a little bit and then you would move the food around in the in the container and then your whole plate would be red I used to love that and they had it, the chicken in this little pouchy looking thing um how, what do you call it it's like you fry it and it has a lot of dough around it so that's how the Chinese store around my way would do it so this is what I was trying to recreate using chickpeas because I don't eat chicken like that anymore y'all know I eat chicken wings here and there but whatever so I let it sit in the chickpeas for a while to infuse I guess <laughs> again I don't know what I'm doing but I was like ooh, let me get the sauce all over the quinoa because we're remixing this this is supposed to be a healthier version I'm not using white rice I'm using quinoa and I'm not using fried rice and I have broccoli on the side because I think there would be broccoli in the tray with it. I can't remember. But everything kind of like thickens up on the quinoa and I liked that. So it was good. It wasn't bad. I feel like I needed like some scallion and a few little onion things. We on an onion recall. So mm, I don't have onions. Uh, but I feel like I needed something extra. Now I used to get a Sprite with my water all the time, but times have changed again. We're eating healthier. So I'm having a kombucha, the strawberry lemonade flavor, and that is the brand Synergy. So anyhow, it didn't turn out bad. It was good. It's just that I felt like it was missing a little something. You see the pool of sauce on the side, like the way I used to have it? <laughs> good times with the Chinese store. Not anymore.